Malaysia is set to share its knowledge and experience with South Africa to help the nation carry out a transformation program in their country's administration. A complete presentation will be presented to the South African government soon with emphasis on execution and implementation. South African President Jacob Zuma had expressed the nation's deep interest in the way the government is executing the National Transformation Program. Areas of interest include economic development projects and programs, which would benefit the majority of South Africans as a whole. President Zuma is also uh, keen to look at uh, how we execute uh, our transformation program the emphasis on execution and implementation uh, and we have uh, created our PAMANDU which is our government uh, delivery unit and uh, he has invited uh, uh, our minister in charge uh, Dr. Jala, to make a visit and to make a complete presentation to the South African government. President Zuma said the issues being tackled under the government's transformation program were similar to the needs of his country in terms of affirmative action, creating jobs and fighting crime. He added South Africa is also looking to enhance its manufacturing sector and is looking at ways to intensify its trade relationship with Malaysia. Uh, Malaysia is one of the biggest investors not only in South Africa but in the continent of Africa. But also South Africa has opportunities. So we thought it was importantly re-looking at our initiatives as well as very specific priorities that coming here will once again add impetus to this relationship and therefore take them to a higher level. I have also invited the Prime Minister to visit South Africa for the same reason. Zuma is currently on a three-day visit to the country in conjunction with the 20th anniversary of diplomatic relations with Malaysia. This is his first visit to the country since he took office in 2009. Dr. Sri Najib also says there's huge business opportunities for Malaysians in developing South Africa. Malaysian companies stand ready uh, to participate in their infrastructure development depending on the terms and condition and the model that's offered to Malaysian companies. Malaysian companies have strength in uh, um, highway construction, uh, power generation, port development, uh, airports, as well as public uh, housing. Malaysia is currently the largest foreign investor in South Africa, standing at 7.5 billion US dollars.